This world is much too beautiful beneath the white blue. Can you see the sky, the sky, the white blue sky? You got to get into that almighty mood. Without it, I shouldn't be even on that camera. And it was you, you people that called me back in, and, and that makes me double happy. You know, I thought I'm already finished, but all, all the time, phones are ringing, we get mail home. Why can't you get back on TV again? So I feel very honored about that. Therefore, I have to really be good. Thank you for doing that. So, now, I tried to make a new show and I try to get a little bit on the abstract side because we have so many artists and most of them I trained. I'm very proud of but uh, two and it's always the same thing. Let me use the knife today as much as I can. So I think about the green, green grass of home. You know, the, you have to really make a story up in your mind and unload the whole story. I like in my mind, I see beautiful green leaf trees. There will be not one fir tree. I paint a lot of fir trees because I live in a fir tree country. Uh, country. And I will have big, big uh, leaf trees with flexing in the water and a bit of land in front. And I will have done it all with the knife. Okay, we put that almighty magic white on. You hear me saying again that almighty magic white? I wish you would think about that too because we all need the encouragement. We all need that. See, because uh, as more as I <coughs> bubble myself up, as better that painting will be. I can go on that painting very miserable and it will be a miserable painting and it will hang on your wall and will cry on your shoulder all the time and you will not like that. I think we all like to see a happy day, a happy beginning of a day. The sparks are flying, the birds are singing, and the sun is shining. Even if the sun doesn't shine, you make it shine. So that's good. Too much magic white is not good. So I cut it down as much as possible. So I do this with the brush because it gets, it, it works faster. I wash my brush, paint dinner, you know this whole deal anyway. Make sure I have a dry brush. Now I get my palette, I put the paint on already, can you see what's on? Just like a piano from light into the dark and zap green I put in the middle. I will put the happy little bit of a blue sky on this time. Start from the top, Taylor blue, Taylor blue, oh, it's a nice, it's a nice blue. I rub it in, rub it in. But you see, I see that painting finish already. I see it all finish, and that makes a big, big difference there. So here I leave a little bit of a light, a couple of bumps out there. If it is too dark, rub it out. Maybe here I show a little bit on blue on the water. So I see that there will be kind of a water stretch. I want to reflect it in the water. And here I put some green in front. I just wash my brush or clean my brush out there. I have too much paint on. So that's good. Wash your brush. Now I will use my almighty knife and we will, I will show you. Now, a dinner paint sticks on a thicker paint, but in this case, I wanted a little bit thinner there because I want to show you, I want to put some green trees on there. I use sap green. And I, this time I like this slippy feeling. Then I, I make my branches right away. You see, if, if this would be drier, I, this would go on right away. But by having it like this, you see what? I, I like this time, this slippery feeling. See, look at that. See, if I keep it drier now, I would, I would have it gone on right away. It would stick right away. But this time, I aimed for that. I want to have it. So, see, say the sun is coming from this side, then I press a little bit harder on this side. See, and, and, and let it go on there. And there's the other tree. That is kind of a abstract, beautiful abstract stuff. 
No, I never painted that way, because as older you get, as more you, how you say, you, you become a different artist. And you will see all the other art, the, the older artists, they have, they develop their own style and their own doing, and then finally that's their landmark and that's, that's the way they will live. See, it's beautiful, isn't it? By doing that, you have all the details. I would say, I just see around big, big trees there. Ah, big bushy trees there. We say we make a happy ending there. <clears throat> a happy ending there. And maybe here we let, we let the uh, sky show a little bit more. So you have to create your own little figures there. You, you have to see it in your mind. If I do it all the same, then it would look, it would look ugly, actually. It, the, the, the variety, the up and downs, the four and backs, the thin and thick. It's always the opposite what makes a painting. If you have it all in the same height, then you get sloppy and you, oh, you start sleeping and then you're dead. And that, we don't want that. See, that's why I create here a couple little paintings there, uh, little trees there. And because being an artist, you know that that's the way it would work better. See? Maybe here, really a little one. Hey. Here, maybe an almighty big one again. See, by having that low, that makes the whole painting exciting. See, I think we learned something. As long as you pain, as more you become a fox. If you watch my ears, they're pointed. And I wiggle my tail because I outsmart my canvases. I want to sell that canvas. I want to make a happy buck with that canvas. And I only can do it when I make it sellable. And if I do it the way I show you, usually that will sell. See? And that makes it nice. Okay. Good. Now, here I will use maybe blue and a darker color on the bottom here. See? On the bottom there. See? That, that's good. That's good. What I did here, black. Can you see what I do? Blue and put it in here. And then use it dark on the bottom. In between some holes, dark. Yeah, very nice abstract. See, 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 Senora. Uh -huh. See there. You always have to think on the bottom is for. See there, you are. there. You are. Now you create three trunks. You can run them in like this. Let one or two stick out there. Maybe here one, here one, here one. That depends on whatever your mood is. You just fire in like that, whistle a happy tune, and do your job with your happy spirit. That happy thought will be in that canvas. Because if you are miserable when you go to that canvas, there will be a miserable painting. See? Uh, maybe here we put some little things in there. See what the knife can do for you? <coughs> it's just fantastic. And you're powerful and fast. <coughs> now I will use a little bit of yellow. And I will just highlight a little bit here from the sunny side. Sunny side on the street. The sunny side. Oh, the sunshine. 
<clears throat> Beautiful. Nice, isn't it? Look, this light, thank you, next to God, you lead the light. You are the almighty leader of light. I want light there, and I have light there. As example, I would like to have light there. Yes, this happened, and it was light there. Isn't that wonderful? See, that's your, you are so powerful on your own canvas, what makes it double nice. Oh, God. Isn't it? Really, sometimes, you know, it, 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 that's my religious thinking. Sometimes you go to bed and you say, Thank you, God, for whatever you give me today. It was a wonderful day. But I made it wonderful myself because I talked about that and <clears throat> I wanted to live happy. I talk about it very much now. I hope you are not sick and tired of that, but I know there's so much misery in this world and if we can give a little bit of happiness, it is worth a lot. <clears throat> yeah, I just put Put on. And can you see by having, like I said to you, having that bit of wet on, the, on my side, so it, it gave me those pulls. See, it gave me this kind of a modern uh, pulling feeling. See? Beautiful. Ah, it's ever nice. So now we fire in. I will, I will. Get, think about that, all that reflects into that water there. Fire that right in. Isn't that wonderful? With a couple strokes, see, that is what I wish you could learn. With a couple strokes, you make a mighty masterpiece. It is awful. When you have to die on one canvas and you fiddle around and fiddle around and you never get finished, you know what you want. I want the freshness. I want that green. I want the trees. I want to walk in in my mind. I want to walk through there on the other side, wherever I come out there in the happy fields in Montana. You ever went to Montana? A beautiful country. Montana is a, oh, I tell you. <coughs> See? And you do it with a couple happy strokes and with a couple happy thoughts. See, harmonize this. See, higher, lower. Here, little, 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 see. <clears throat> and look what the nice penny is already looking at me. And now I get, I get excited, more excited by seeing what I'm doing. <clears throat> See, and that makes it nice. When, you can, when your own work excites you, then, then you are in good shape. And all that you can do with that almighty knife. And that's what I like so much. See, see, see. Now we will, we will fire in this one here. On this side. A little bit more. See, now I will thank, I will thank. Maybe I put a bit of white, look what I do here. Bit of white, but the highest. I, I want to give a high tune all of a sudden. In that little bit of here, where we come down, we come down, we come down there, we come. See? I come in there. You feel like, you feel like you, you want to walk through that low into this side and see see what happened this side touch of red i mix myself a kind of a happy happy oh not like ochre but in a kind of a reddish that's too red too red i grounded myself i showed you how you shouldn't do it i take from here and i i see i, I ruined all that but I can do it because I have lots of paint. <laughs> you see, I'm ahead of you. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> the, and I will create kind of a sandy beach there. 
kind of a sandy, sandy spot there. Look at that. Look at that. Now you don't talk loud anymore, you only whisper. You only whisper. See? Now you use your big brush. Make sure you have a nice dry brush. Look what I, oh, wait a minute, before I go on, I should, see, I want to cheat. I need that yellow in there. I only went up to here. I'm glad I thought about it. See, put it on, just see how, see what, this is what I want to show you. Because of our paint, we can do those wonderful things. This paint is, has a built-in, power it will always see it give one stroke you see a mighty stroke there is not a sloppy stroke i could slop it off and and uh, i wish you f would see that see uh, on this side here look at look at look at the, look at the details how m so many details with one almighty stroke see this is the uh, it's the way to paint see oh, me here a little bit a little bit, that's good. Now I will use my big brush, and you, you, like this. You have only two sides, one side like this, then the other side like this, and then wash the brush. Look, all that paint on, wash the brush. Don't go on and go on and go on and mess up that whole painting. See, I could go on and on and, and remodel that whole painting. See, one side, Turn around the other side. Beautiful. But look, I got to wash it. I cannot allow myself to, because then I, I would ruin that whole painting. Again, one side, turn around the other side. See, all that paint, wash it off. So for some time you have to be a brush washer, but that's okay. If you can have a good result, then do it. See? One stroke, the other stroke. Wash your brush. One stroke, the other stroke. Wash your brush. One stroke, other stroke. So I made it. Not beautiful. Look at that. So fine. Now you do it like this. Look at that. Oh, God. Isn't that ever nice? Beautiful. Now the next step will be, I put a couple, <coughs> couple tree trunks in here, especially for that bigger tree. See, <coughs> couple tree trunks. I mean, just the bigger trees I want to bring out. I'll make it a bit crooked. See? Fires right into the water. Uh -huh. See? Next one. Maybe this one. We make it really. And it's exciting, isn't it? It's a beautiful, you see that your beautiful results in such a short time, your heart is pumping good, your blood is running good, everything has a good, you're in good shape. And that makes it good. That's good living. <clears throat> then art had a meaning. If art makes you happy, makes you healthy, then 
art was good for you. And if it doesn't do that, then it's something has gone wrong. That was not the right message then, maybe. <laughs> See, <coughs> now I will use my big brush again and <coughs> just cut it down a little bit. You always think you get to buy it twice. Turn the brush over. See, I only clean it up now with a very loose, loose, loose stroke. That like you, you clean the tears. See the difference between there and there? Just clean the tears. There you are. <coughs> now the next step will be I finish up. I finish up that shoreline maybe here. See, I, I, I look for power now. I would like to see a little bit more. Maybe that brings it out more. This will do a better job there, right in front. That's why the guys come around the bench and they were fishing in here. <coughs> no, we will, we will, we will. We will do it like this. You know, and, and it's funny, as more you get on, on work on your canvas, as more excited I get here. And I think that is what I want to say. That is good living. Good living. Now we will we will create a kind of a other side. This is this side. Yellow and green, we put it together. And I just see. Look at that. And that can be so nice. It is, uh, it is still a normal, wonderful painting, but it's all done by your knife. And it's all original because it is your, your own thought. You just put yourself in this kind of a landscape and you fired off and made that beautiful painting there. See? And now if you if you get more excited, if you want to have something more done too, you can sometimes I feel I, I need a, a walk to that lake and then you are the opposite side. They use kind of a gray, see but white and gray and red, black, tune of black there. And <coughs> I would say here is a happy road coming out there. See, a happy little road coming out from here. Ending up in the water there. See, make it wider perspective, make it inviting, like it becomes really nice now when you make it Perspective right, the wider, wider, wider. Yes, wider. Oh, 
God has a wonderful perspective road. It invites you. You open the door and it invites you right into that almighty painting. And that is good living. That's good living. After you have finished with that painting, you sit back and you feel so good. It's a, just a devil of a nice feeling that you can handle that yourself. And it is original, what I like so much on. Maybe here we go a little bit darker, a little bit of a darker rim. It's on the road, due to on the roadside is always something, little ditches or whatever. On the other side you can do the same thing. See? So, now we just, we just, just go over the whole thing and see where we can, you could, see even you can highlight now, if you want, you can highlight this. See, you can highlight this a little bit. See, then actually you would have to highlight in the water too. See, I just would like to see a little bit of a, in the water, uh, uh, coming right down to the water edge there and make a final line there. See, maybe here a little bit. And, and, maybe here a little bit more. And that is. No, I think this is nice. Nice painting. Did you enjoy it? A little bit abstract. It's powerful. And you live hard and powerful, and it gives you a nice painting. Thank you for watching me. Bye bye.